Hi guys, you might be wondering what this is, and I thought it was a cool thing. Uh, I, I put it up to monitor this. Uh, this is just a bonus, it's an infrared camera. Well, this is the fun, fun part. So what this is, is a, a motion activated camera that will record when, uh, when I get visitors. <laughs> so, so I have some bird seed on that plate and our friendly neighbor birdies come visit so I put this up uh, today the 26th of January and what is this anyway <coughs> this is an int integrated uh, PiCam server operating system basically which you put on a, on a Raspberry Pi and uh, there's different solutions for this and uh, this one is the one I chose you can basically plug in as many USB cameras as you want into this and it's just camera one camera two etc and you can control everything here so camera two is an usb one this is one co connected directly to the pi board <laughs> yeah uh, you, you can basically control everything you can choose uh, resolution and frame rate and all that good stuff you can put this uh, file storage you can put it on upload it somewhere uh, i used to have an ftp server on my on my hypervisor uh, which it uploaded to, but I'm just saving this locally because this is mo more of a fun thing for me right now. You can have text overlays, you can do sh working schedules for it, etc. There is no end to this, the stuff you can do with this. This is basically a surveillance system in a Raspberry Pi. Yeah, so I'm using this uh, high-tech system to monitor my, my neighbors. <laughs> that is, my birdie neighbors. <laughs> Yeah, so let's have a look at uh, the setup I have physically. Okay, so just connected it here. This is the Raspberry Pi unit. This is the infrared camera, this one. And I basically just <laughs> taped a regular webcam to a mini tripod and uh, pointed it towards where my bird seed is. And yeah, so this isn't a very big, big device. Uh, I have this uh, small plastic cover over it. So this w there is pass through, uh, you know, those power banks, there's pass through power banks where you can connect the power bank <coughs> to uh, a wall socket and then connect it to your Raspberry Pi. So that would mean you have a UPS backup system. So if you want to use this as a, as a surveillance for some for, for burglars or whatever, you can have it connected to your internet, uploading it to cloud storage, and uh, it will. You can have a power bank in between, which uh, even if they cut the power to your house or if the power is cut for some reason, it would still work for as long as uh, the power bank can supply power to unit yeah so just remember that if you have a lot of usb cameras it's going to be power hungry so yeah test that out but it works for it works for uh, <laughs> surveillance of uh, birdies yeah <laughs> 